I doubt I'll be doing a Be Kind channel thing today. This is for family and friends. This is my vlog. I'm uh, in the process of doing a license plate for Brandon's car. I've got a lot to do on it. It's taking longer than the one that I did Nick because of the different shades of light and dark and all that stuff. Um, I'm a tad bit depressed today. I don't know how to say that any other way. So what's got me depressed? Well, to really be blunt about it, just one thing. And my doctor told me that this would happen, but I cracked my shoulder, cracked my elbow, tore several muscles in my arm, taking a bad fall. And she told me it could take up to four to five months for this thing to heal. I'm tired of going to bed at night and having to severely drug myself just to get any kind of sleep. Our bodies require, require sleep, but I don't get any rest. It's like I told Linda, uh, you know, my hand doesn't do what I want it to. Um, I drop stuff. I knock stuff over. I'll give you an example. Picking that up. Those are paint brushes on, sitting on top of an oil painting set. Then I got quart cans of sign paint over there to do all this stuff with. And Nothing like reaching for something and knocking over a coffee can full of paint brushes and having to pick them up. I, I'm not really feeling sorry for myself. I'm just really angry about it all. My own stupidity caused all of it. Um... Zara Rose and Tigger have already been out in the office giving Papa lovings and saying hi and we got a box full of kittens in there. That's what they were really going to look at. Um, and uh, cleaning the place up, it got nasty. We're doing that. It's a slow process there too. You know, it doesn't matter who you are. If you're a human being, one of the things that happens is you just start bringing home more stuff. And I have a Zen philosophy, and that's why I'm going to try to develop a website and get rid of a bunch of my stuff. Zen philosophy is less is more. You know, and that's not how it is right now. I got more junk in here. It's totally crowded up. There's like 20 guitars in here, uh, a drum set, amplifiers, just all kinds of stuff, and I don't really need any of it. So I'm going to sell a bunch of it. I'm not going to give it away. Uh, some of this is really expensive stuff, but there is a, a deal going on right now in real estate. The real estate market is not that good in most places. Why is that? Folks, there just isn't any money out there to buy anything. If you have a good job, I propose you keep it. Uh, That's great. I just got paint thinner in my right eye. I had to clean paint off my hands. Um, hold that thought. I gotta get me another swig here. Oh!
You know, been paying attention to things. Warrenthal James Simpson, O.J. Simpson, died yesterday. It's a guy named Buddy Brown saying, well, he's not liking it now where he's at. Well, first of all, you know, a jury can judge, and I personally don't believe he should have been acquitted. I think he did commit the murder, double murders. But, uh, you know, if the du glove doesn't fit, you must acquit. Well, you could see he was flexing his hands when he was trying the gloves on, and they wouldn't slide on. Those were driving gloves, folks, and I'm going to make a comment on something. I hope that uh, they don't strike this down, but driving gloves are supposed to be uh, supposed to fit very tightly. They're made out of calfskin leather. What happens to leather when you get it wet? and those gloves were gotten wet. Leather shrinks, it doesn't swell, it shrinks. They never took that into account. Another thing that the prosecution did and the police department did is they planted evidence. You know, we're either a nation that is ruled by just laws or we're not, and right now we're not. The That's just a fact, it's a two to justice system. If you're rich, you get treated one way. If you're poor, you get treated another way. It's been that way for a long time. But also, if the powers that be, if you're a prominent individual and you're wealthy and the powers that be do not like you, they will castigate you and prosecute you endlessly. That is going on with someone right now. You probably know who I'm talking about. So what does a person do during all this? Well, I'm trying to just have a good attitude and not get depressed and not feel helpless. It ain't working right now, but it'll get better. I'm going to do this, get it uploaded. I'm not going to work out here today. I've been out here every day this last week, and I'm tired. I'm going to go in and do a whole lot of nothing. Um, now, there is scary things coming, but guess what? There are good things coming, too. Take time in your life to enjoy the little pleasantries is the best way I'll describe it. Those things that give you pleasure that are wholesome and, and godly, that's some of the best stuff on the planet. I mean, just going out and sitting in the sun and feeling the breeze sometimes makes a lot of difference. Well, I, uh, I don't have anything profound to say today. I just don't. I'm really tired. I'm in a lot of pain right now, actually, and, and I wish I'd have never fallen and busted that shoulder. It, uh, it's the shoulder. This one is the one that got replaced. It's got a synthetic shoulder. This is the one they had to put a plate on my scapula and screws in my, my shoulder and just all kinds of crap. Um, uh, due to another bad fall I had. But while you're out and about, or if you're home and doing things at home, I want you to think of something. You have a family. Almost everyone I know that watches this channel has a family. I would like you to Hold your family close and love on them every chance you get. I had those two little grandkids in here and got hugs from both of them. Told them I really didn't want to be bothered, which bothered uh, Zara Rose a little bit. But um, this just isn't a good day for people to socialize with me when my son Benjamin came in. 
I told him I'm not really fit company today and I'm trying to be. Now, before I let you go and before I shut this vlog down, know that this crazy, crippled, ugly old man, fat, crazy, crippled and ugly old man loves you with everything he's got to love you with, I do. Being depressed and down the dumps doesn't stop that. And like that sign up there says, be kind, always be kind, bye.